Before you begin, it's important to thoroughly review the user guide that came with your Cybex Eternus S car seat. When you remove your car seat from the box, you'll find this guide tucked behind the harness. When you're done reviewing the user guide, be sure to store it behind the car seat. To start, we'll remove the lower anchors from their storage position. Raise the headrest to its highest position and unbuckle the harness. Unfasten the snaps on the car seat cover and push the buckle through the seat pad to expose the lower anchor storage compartment. Open the storage compartment, pull out the lower anchor strap and close the compartment door. Route the lower anchor strap through the rear facing belt path. Make sure the strap is flat and is positioned in front of the buckle. Reattach the seat pad. Place the car seat rear facing on your vehicle seat. There are four rear-facing recline positions available. Check the level indicator and adjust the car seat to one of these four positions. The recline ball should be positioned in the blue zone for rear-facing use. Next, attach each lower anchor connector to the corresponding lower anchor bar in the vehicle. Place one hand in the center of the car seat and push down firmly into your vehicle seat. With your other hand, Pull the lower anchor adjustment strap through the rear-facing belt path to tighten. You can use the adjuster strap on either side of the car seat. Recheck your level indicator to make sure the recline ball is still in the blue zone for rear-facing use. Reattach the seat pad. Using one hand, grab the car seat near the rear-facing belt path. Try to move the car seat. It shouldn't move more than one inch from side to side or front to back. If it moves more than an inch, try to tighten the installation again. If it still moves more than an inch, try a different installation method or a different seating position in your vehicle. Finally, extend your linear side impact protection device. The LSP is only used if you're installing your car seat next to the vehicle door.